love message for August 1st, 2019, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, your first card out is the Six of Wands, bottom of the deck, Temperance. Something that you have been waiting for and soul searching for is coming to fruition successfully, Libras. This is huge. This is a divine partnership. The divine masculine, the divine feminine, healing coming together successful movement the energy of your person these energies can be vice versa especially if you're cross watching so just put yourself where it fits all right the energy of your person the chariot big energy finally moving towards you um, you see the chariot is facing the six of wands so they could have had to um, separate or complete a life cycle with somebody else that they shared a home with, a life with. What's the energy coming in for this relationship? I did, I draw um, focus cards or one major arcana card for the focus of you guys and you got the chariot actually as your focus um, clarified by the high priestess. So, um, your divine partner could have had to leave a different marriage or different, well, marriage, I guess, leave a different situation in order for the two of you to come together um, through this divine, uh, you know, guidance or knowledge, if that made sense. That seemed like it didn't make sense. <laughs> All right. The energy coming towards you, Libra. Could be dealing with a... Fire sign, that's Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Cancer, Sagittarius here. Six of Cups. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Bottom of the deck, Lovers. So the energy coming towards you is coming back together. This is a reunion with a past life soulmate. Um, six of Wands and Six of Pentacles is Spirit's advice. In your outcome, you have... The Nine of Cups, clarify, or bottom of your deck and shared energy is the Four of Wands, clarified with the nine, Page of Swords and the Ten of Pentacles. Ace of Wands is the next card in the bottom of your deck. Okay, so shared energy. This is coming, um, the energy between the two of you. You're both wanting this stable relationship. You're both wanting, uh, you know, to move forward, to find a home together, to just... This is just really about building stability between the two of you. It's been a very unstable situation up to this point. The chariot is um, uh, cased on both sides with sixes. This is the material or the spiritual realm. This is the material realm. Seven is a very spiritual number in between. Um, seven days. Uh, for some of you, this is going to come together. So, uh, clarifying that four of wands, you're wanting it all. You don't want just a sometime person. You want the whole thing. Um, and you haven't spoken of that to this point. Um, you could have been in the past looking in on them and their family situation, but, um, the shared energy is the two of you are going to come together, uh, sharing this, this foundation to build a solid structure on. This is also uh, a twin flame card for me. This is the reunion of a soulmate. Um, and with it having success, uh, my goodness, I need to stop talking or uh, stop shuffling at the same time, one of the two. <laughs> okay, let's call in some cards. What's the sun? Beautiful. Okay, what's the six of wands for, for our Libras? The Hermit and the Three of Cups in reverse. So we are successfully leaving a third party. And we are successfully coming out of silence, out of seclusion. Um, you could have secluded yourself to the point where it was beginning to, you were beginning to be too disconnected. You are successfully coming out of that Hermit. 
you are successfully getting out of this third party. Bottom of the deck is sun. Um, your path is being illuminated for you to move forward. Um, why is the chariot here? The queen of swords. So they were going through a transformation. They couldn't come towards you until they um, went through that transformation. But they are cutting themselves out of a another relationship and coming towards you. Uh, Libra, you could have put your foot down saying, I'm not doing this anymore. I'm not going to be silent. I'm not going to be a third party. So if you want to successfully move in my direction, you better successfully move away from that other person. Um, the energy coming in for you is uh, bringing the spiritual into the material, this past life soulmate um, connection for you. Why is the six of cups here? This is also just love and happiness in every area of your life. It's Look at all the cups. They're overflowing with um, vegetation with plants with uh, beauty you know it's it's a, all about old relationships past connections joy and nostalgia there's like a, a renewal a new cycle that's what I just heard why is the six of cups here yes a new cycle you've been patiently waiting for the return of this person this is profit or not profit uh, like growth and progress with this person it's this has been very hard but you've been patient you've planted your seeds and now this new cycle is here that is going to bear the fruits of your labor your your waiting is paying off because the star is coming in for you the sun as well once again the two of you are meant to be on each other's path this is divine timing it's meant to come together the two of you were meant to be together but you both had to leave your own situations and do the healing it takes in order for this to move together but now it's time to move this together because divine timing is here and spirit's advice it is to follow your passion to be confident to be sure of yourself and to find that balance um there's that sun again follow where your intuition is leading you be confident and sure of yourself could be dealing with a leo as well because we do have strength at the bottom we have the sun and the queen all cards of leo so Libra, you could be moving in the direction of Leo, uh, Leo or all this is happening in the time frame of Leo. But either way, your path is being illuminated. Follow your intuition and do what it is that you want. What do you want in this life? This is all about having the courage and the faith to take action and move in the direction that's going to bring you balance. Um, and you could be stepping right into your divine purpose in this world. Uh, your outcome is the nine of cups. So this is success, abundance, prayers being answered, well-being, um, happy and secure future, feeling whole again, even by yourself. Also, this is about spiritual fulfillment um, and being able to create an abundant life. Very beautiful. You're like achieving this next level. Wow. Wow. And success, change, movement, it's all coming in for you. All this movement is bringing you everything that you have been hoping for, Libra. Bringing you balance, bringing you happiness, um, leaving the sadness behind and moving forward. Um, your prayers have been answered. Your prayers have been heard and they're bringing you answers. All right, let's get one card of guidance for our Libras, please. One card of guidance for Libra. Thank you. Quiet time. Take some time alone to rest, meditate, and contemplate, which you most definitely have been in that hermit. Um, clarified with true love, the romantic stirrings in your heart have propelled the universe to deliver great love to you. There's that nine of cups. It's coming. It is coming, my Libra friends. All right, guys. I hope you have a beautiful and blessed day. Make sure you check out my Vimeo later today. I did a three-month um, love outlook, what's coming in, what's going out, what you need to know to bring in your soulmate, all the good information. It's going to be there. It hasn't been uploaded yet, but it will be up there by early this afternoon. So check it out. All right, my friends have a beautiful and blessed day.